It actually started, I believe, was a uh, congressman in Texas uh, had come into his office one day knowing his wife and his daughter were coming to meet him for lunch. And as he was walking through his office, he saw the Victoria's Secret catalog and panicked. Didn't want his wife to think he was doing something bad. So he went on a rampage to find out why that Victoria's Secret catalog was being sent to him. And what he found was is that he had recently applied for a credit card. And when he applied for the credit card, his information was immediately sold to Victoria's Secret. And Victoria's Secret sent him a catalog. He thought that was outrageous. So he put together a bill uh, to make it go away. I was always surprised. Everybody always names bills after themselves or certain things that take place. And I thought it should have been Victoria's Law, Victoria's Act, whatever. It wasn't. The cool thing was is that it really was a secret because you and nobody else know that it exists. So every time someone runs credit on you, uh, someone who buys information from the credit bureaus has access to your name, your address, and sometimes even your phone number. I myself personally buy stuff from a credit agency, names, addresses, and phone numbers for solicitation too. So there's a pretty cool website, it's uh, pretty simple to get on. I believe it is www.optoutprescreen.com. If you go on to that website and you opt out, when I or anybody else runs your credit, your information won't be sold to anybody. It's like a giant do not call list for your credit information. And there are a lot of people buying your credit information.